Hello all, we are here for one more lesson of this AutoCAD 2016 training course and the topic for today will be uh, how to edit uh, uh, external reference in place or in your local drawing. Uh, I've started with the uh, drawing uh, with views for our uh, last lesson regarding the external references and if you recognize this you can see that we still have the circle which is uh, an entity belonging to the current drawing sir and we have this rectangle that is inserted here as an external reference so what we've seen in our previous lesson was um, the update uh, taking advantage of the link that the external reference does and so when you uh, want to change the file that is inserted then you go to the original file and when you update it here then you'll get the new geometry but there are possibilities to make this addition inside uh, this drawing where it's inserted so for that we can click on top of the external reference and you see now the entities are highlighted and you get these options here so basically this function here will open or close the dialog box belonging uh, to the external references then you have these clipping possibilities which I will show you uh, a little later then you can open the, the reference on a separate window and edit this in place. So I will edit this in place. I need to choose and make the OK. And uh, what happens it is that I get a set of new options. Okay. Uh, basically, you still have the clipping boundaries, but you can, uh, more important than that, it is to change this and because of the connection through the external reference you'll get the drawing changed so if you make uh, edit we'll edit this again um, let me open this I can make save changes, okay, and okay, I'm back. So I've put myself on the same position where this was started, um, and I will open the original drawing of the rectangle to show you that um, this is changed. So rec open and the original drawing that uh, was inserted uh, on this file was changed through this file okay so uh, we have another possibility there which is create a clipping boundary or remove it so we can create a boundary we have a couple of options um, we can come here and say new boundary. We can set, for example, a, a polygon or select a polyline or a rectangle. It's all the same, but for example, I can say rectangular, specify a rectangle, and then you get this kind of view. Okay, this is a clipping boundary, and this boundary, if you click on top of it, you can change what it is seen okay and this is done for the external reference entities not for the original ones okay and you can for sure uh, at any moment say remove clipping and you can delete it and you'll get to the original status okay so this is uh, important because this idea of making the addition of the of the external reference file 
uh, on the on the drawing where it is inserted it is very important because show you show you a different possibility to edit the drawing and uh, show you that this connection uh, through the external reference is done through um, both directions either the external reference original file or the file where it was inserted so i hope this was clear and i hope that um, this example was um, easy enough so that you can use this in your uh, drawings